So why if you're only missing one tooth, why get a dental implant over a traditional bridge? Well, the traditional bridge involves grinding down adjacent healthy teeth often. And what that can do by grinding down the teeth to get a cap, you can damage the tooth. You can damage the nerve or pulp, end up with a root canal, and then end up with an abscess later on. So if we don't have to touch a tooth, it's a better treatment option. The implant is more of a regenerative replacement. It's like a third set of teeth. So we're gonna place that implant in between the teeth without touching them. And it has a firm base, it doesn't decay. It's made of titanium, so that can't decay like a tooth with a cap on it. And it doesn't touch the teeth, so you won't damage the teeth to get further decay on those. And it can function like your own tooth. And these so are like permanent a, teeth. It's like a permanent tooth. And in the long run, financially, obviously, it can even save you money, because if the implant, over time lasts much longer than a bridge which goes seven to 10 years. Why would you wanna invest in something that's gonna fail and or cause more problems in the future? So is that the future of dentistry? That whether it's 50 years or 100 years, that if you're missing one tooth, you're gonna get an implant? Absolutely, it's a future of dentistry. It's a whole paradigm shift that I've seen in the profession over the past 20 years. That's why it's so popular. I'm teaching all these other doctors these techniques. Why? Because they, people come into their practice, they're educated that they need dental implants instead of the conventional grinding down their teeth. What about pain? It does seem painful. Well, the surgery itself. What do they say? What do the patients say? To be honest, the surgery is not that painful. For anybody who's gone through a root canal or tooth loss, extraction of a tooth or a root canal is much more painful than precision implant surgery. The technology we have today enables us to place these implants in a very delicate manner. They heal within a few months, and the patients usually feel, feel very little during the procedure. Often, sometimes they tell me they take no pain medication. This week, I probably had two patients told me they took one Tylenol just to be on the safe side before the Novocaine wore off. So pain is really not something to be worried about. Not at all. And, and if for those patients who are nervous, we have sedative techniques, we could do sedation, we could make it so they just wake up and have a tooth. If someone in your family was missing just one tooth, would you, I mean, there's no way you'd give them a bridge. Without a doubt, I'm gonna do it. There's no implant. way you'll do a bridge. Without a doubt, I'm doing an implant.